Hello everyone and welcome back to La Mulana 2. I'm Ranjako and he's here with me. Dark is here with me as usual. The wall is moving. Yes it is. Just making sure you know. Pants on! Hmm, our time doesn't seem to come. I'm pretty sure he says something beyond that. Okay. I did not mean to go right back in, but. Whatever. That's better. I said better. Hello, Mega Rock. What in the fuck are you? It's Mega Rock. Yeah, it's not a race that Yep. What is this to do again? Oh! That one! Yeah! yeah. That! Convenient! Ain't it though? Ready. Remember? Uh, no. Remember yeah, this thing? Yeah. Put in the belly of the crawling infernal fiend. And then you yeah. look at that icon there in the tablet and uh... Oh. <laughs> How does it hit you through a wall? Reasons. Oh boy. Been a while since we found one of gone. those. Well, shit. The land of the puny had born something big. From the mother of the puny, dumb bodied ones. Real big ones with two legs and whatnot. Fools who fail to heed our words. Puny serpentine dumbasses fulfill our will. Foolish puny little snake dumbasses. Dumbas snakes crawling on the ground. Taiji puny snakes. We shall speak with the leader of the large ones. They must return their bearded mother to the skies. Um, whoever wrote these is kind of an asshole. Pretty sure about 12 people wrote those. And all of them were assholes. Oh yeah, we did speak with him before. Yeah, they we've been here before. Shut up. Oh, of course. That was just unfortunate. Mm -hmm. Well, we killed one of the four guardians. Can I read this yet? System. Activate Typhoon access. Modern I'm clone sorry. records. What? Computer memory bank. Re records of the creation of our mother clone, our race, born from chaos, sought the mother's power. From the remains of a woman of the first children, we attempted to draw out the power to create life itself. Number one, Noah. We I don't like where this is going. We instilled a decayed body with the power of the pyramid, and awaited the manifestation of power. Temporarily imbued with life, the body was able to produce the spider of life. However, it was destroyed in the Tower of Ruin, for it liked even the power to move from the pyramid's face, rendering it useless. We killed the Nuwa! <laughs> yeah, and that ain't the only serpentine person we killed. Number yep. two, Tiamat. Saw that coming. While that which was created was much larger than those of our race, it manifested the power to beget life. Eleven inhuman monsters were born. The entity Sky escaped with its offspring to another dimension. By using its dimension bending powers, the plans had been ruined. Number 3. Echidna. Mother of monsters. Our final hope, to which we have committed all of our power, 
Utilizing the fruits of our previous labors, we used the body of one of our own daughters. As with Tiamat, eleven monsters were born, after which they fell into sleep in their larval forms. We shall wait for these children to awaken. We shall wait for the time with, when they, aw they awaken once again to unleash their power. We shall rule over Eglana. No, you ain't. Computer memory bank. The Chimera technology acquired from the civilization of the first children. Originally, the technology was used to switch the serpentine legs of the first children with those of a different bipedal being. Then we developed the technology further to apply the mental capacity of yet another being, providing power superior to that of a human. However, Chimera fight beings retain part of Nibiru's consciousness. They become soldiers living for the purpose of fulfilling, fulfilling Nibiru's will. They can control of the stars and the ceiling of La Mulana and Eglana. Hmm. What do we notice as being... as Kimirifying himself with a lot of things? Hmm. Also? Remember this room? Uh, 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 disgusting. At least you can kind of just waste it. Yup. Good riddance. Yup. This boy, this platform doesn't look familiar at all. Hmm. Oh, you're ugly. Yeah, there was a similar platform in the first game that crushes you directly on their needs. So, <laughs> <laughs> if you remember, you'd usually try to get to the side and then Taiwan just splits open and crushes you. If you do exactly that. <laughs> it's kinda mean. Oh, hi, Apostle, and a Griffon. And a fairy. Yes. You might notice. That statue goes back up every time I get into this room. Mm -hmm. Guess I need to be further here. There we go. That's better. Was it? Yep. Oh, right, it's closed. Right, because, you know. One for the priestess, three for the griffon. Yeah, 
Oxygen. Breathing. The twins protect an ancient key, the cog that turns the great mechanism. The twins protect a beast's jaw. Yeah. Mm. We need to get in there, but you know, we kind of need the other... The wind mantra for that. Oh hey, the statue we sent up. It's gonna go ahead and equip that. Yeah, of course, the Griffin. Yeah, we already knew there was gonna be a Griffin. Boy, it feels nice to be overpowered. Boy, I know it's not gonna last very long. Perfume! A perfume for ritual use that dates back to ancient times. Where to become able to fell blue skeletons. Fucking finally! Well, so while we're here... Um, your turn. Skella. Yeah, right. A beautiful woman whose lower half is a machine, creating experiments about their children in an attempt to replicate the mother. While seemingly beautiful at a glance, they will attack you with an assault unit that is modeled after a dog's head. That was an attempt. Hmm. Eros. A figure who, call who could be said to represent the fall of the races. He calls himself the Sex Sage, completely naked and always ready for action, should the opportunity to get freaky arise. Freak. Uh, we did read that one. Yeah, we've read that one. Mega Rock. He hates his own features, which look like a wild cartoon, and runs his shop inconspicuously. Perhaps being out of touch with people for so long is the reason he seems a little high. Hey, then. Alright, now we can go here. Actually. Yay, finally! <laughs> There's more to read. Yeah, yeah, I was checking something on my monitor. Ah. The Glacia Labolas, a demon summoned from the chaos of Eglana. Glacia Labolas is highly intelligent and capable of using advanced magic. His will to destroy his enemies is so strong that he will continue to attack even after death. Eh. Mm. Sort of, I guess. I mean, he did make that thing fall down on us. Yeah, he did drop a rock on us. Or try to. So... Oh yeah, we didn't read this one. Nope. <clears throat> The Raijin Infusion. Once people of the Kotamatsu race, these brothers will turn into creatures of war by the Sky People. Their fighting powers are preserved in the horns sprouting from their heads, which they use to materialize storm and wind. That's awesome. Blue skeleton. Now that we finally got to kill one. A skeleton occupied by a dead soul, strengthened further by means of sorcery. Smashing them apart, originally the only means of driving them back, is no longer an option. They will keep coming back forever. Only by purging them with sacred water can you permanently destroy them. Which now we have. Shortcut. Yeah, sadly I forgot I needed to go the other way to open that first, but oh well. Rip. Oh my. Mobile Super X3 Plus acquired. Yay, we have more RAM! That's a lot more RAM. Yeah, about twice as much, in fact. We'll go through that door later. 
Yeah, what's that statue in the background, though? Oh, that? Statue of Chaos. <laughs> Bears a striking, striking resemblance to the Chaos, the primeval state of existence in Greek mythology. Chaos is thought to be the state of disarray that existed before the world was created and from which the Earth was born. Hmm. Yeah, that's gonna be relevant. Maybe. That was close. Yup. <laughs> I'm so glad I can finally kill those assholes. Alright, so that's. Ghost. That goes there. Okay, I don't need to turn it up. <laughs> oh, I hadn't opened that one. Not that way. <laughs> you can go see her again, though. Sometime after you last left, two men came here. After attempting to break that seal on the gate by force, they gave up and tried to dig into the wall instead. I prefer not to have you people behaving like that here in our temple. The younger man started swinging his whip about the moment he saw me. He was extremely <laughs> rude. Were they friends of yours? <laughs> I wonder why! <laughs> that misses me to know him. Back! Back, demon! Yo, what the fuck? Oh, okay. Bye. <laughs> Let me just get out of your way. Yeah, like, that one new weather. <laughs> okay, so still the wrong direction for that, but I might have turned this... Yeah. Puzzle! What's important is what's inside. Try sitting. Try placing your hand upon it. Uh huh. Ow. Rude. It's the axe! Now you need to get to it somehow. Like this. <laughs> The all powerful axe. It's not quite as, pow quite as powerful as in the first game, but it still does a lot of damage. It just doesn't really get affected by Vashra because it's just, you know. <laughs> Slow. I mean, you can't really have a combo with that kind of a tank. Try getting out there. There we go. I should do it. Actually, while well, we're here. That right back again. That way we should be able to get back to that exit. Secret orb. I think we're only missing one.
this leads well here basically yeah we seal the kingdom with our power if you seek the power to destroy a kingdom defeat the 11 children the cog will reawaken this land yeah, see the, the cog area down there? Yeah. Yeah. Also, a map. We finally have a map. Shortcut. Also, this. We didn't have that one before, but you know. Kinda useful. This is the Hall of Malice, where hatred begotten slumbers. Look at that nice icon on the corner. Yeah, the Alfier icon, right? I meant the one on the bottom left, but yes. I, I know. <laughs> also, yeah, map once again somewhat resembles the... Yeah. Yeah, like that. Oh boy, I already scanned that one. And that one. It's been a while since we've been in here. Yeah. We didn't have double jumps. The hidden relic of several generations lives in the eternal prison. Hidden treasure sealed by a secret key. Yeah, yeah. Oh boy! I'm sure there was something like down there. Maybe it was down at the bottom. Yeah, probably. Oh well, not where I was trying to go anyway. That's a secret thing. <laughs> Bergelmir, the giant, rules over the world of frost. When the earth and moon are seen in heaven. That's what the hint was! in the center. Yeah, we won't be here for a while. Anyway, we have more places to be and things Sounds to do. Sounds like get. a hot nope. Yeah, let's, uh, let's go here instead. This place is safer. It's really nice to be able to do that now. Stuff sucks. Buy it anyway. Yeah, to this remind me, we might be able to get the money fighting now. Got nothing to lose, do we? No, I'm just getting other things first.
Ame no Tokotachi. Takamaga Hara Shrine was used to seal a white escape sky people, the Anunnaki. However, its power has waned, and now their soldiers are making their way here. Be especially cautious of the one called Daji, with I the power of the king. This guy before. Yep. He also guards the machine of knowledge and the item known as the Egg of Creation, which he hides on his person. Yes. Because I remembered him saying that. Yep. We'll be getting that soon. Oh, there. You are bad. Yeah, I just want to go save and that. Yeah, right here. Hmm. Is it really a save? I don't think that's a save point. Mm, no, it just opens the teleport point. Yeah, that's about to say. Now we're gonna go save. There you go. And heal. Healing is good. So let me tell you, we shouldn't have much of a trouble beating him now. Just gonna ask him a question? No, I'm just gonna go and use the katana, really. It's a lot faster. Hmm. First, however, to ye hefty ones, we shall pass on our wisdom. Yes, our very tower which rules the skies. Those who do not abide shall enter their eternal dirt nap. This land is ours. Screw the mother. Kind of assholes. That's a word for it. Not on this. Oh, we already broke that. Yeah, not on Minas at all, huh? Why you save? Uh huh. All right. Let's see if maybe the axe is better. Not falling is also a good idea. Probably. It would help if you weren't getting yourself yeeted into the spikes every time. Yeah, I need to be more careful with these attacks. This will be funny. Yep. It's so slow. Ego creation acquired. Squished. Yay, we did the thing. Let's go save. Nah. Whatever the egg creation is for, at least. Well, it's a usable. An artifact that details the legend of fall creation. Press the item button to display it. Whee! Did you have something to say about it? What's that? The egg of creation? What the hell can the bird lay that egg? 
<laughs> Very helpful, helpful. Very helpful. Hey, where does Heron go? Well, um, I think he's running out of money. <laughs> Also, there is one thing I've been meaning to do for a while, and since we're about to run out of time, I might as well get this over with. Don't remember the exact... Oh, there's also that. Can I get them? Yep, that still applies. Yeah. I miss a Kosugi. Hmm. Uh, before we read that. This place is a challenge. Right. Uh, should we? Shun Kosugi. Oh boy. <laughs> Looking fly over there. Race. Modern human. The Mrs. father and renowned archaeologist. Loves curry. I meant to gain fame amongst his peers by solving the mystery of La Milana ruins, which he also sort of accidentally destroyed, and is currently keeping things on the DL. <laughs> he resented his father, also an archaeologist, for stealing the fruits of his labors. But the two have put aside their differences now, working together to support Lumisa. Speaking of which... Sean. A legendary archaeologist and Lumisa's grandfather. In his old age, he is retired from research, though it would not appear his appetite for rummaging through ruins has not yet fully been sated. No shit. Oh, what? How old is Lumisa supposed to be, though? Old enough. Yeah, but if... If... Uh... Uh... I already forgot his name, oh my god. Sean? I just... No, 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 uh... Le Mesa? Le, yeah, le, uh, Le Mesa. Yeah, Le Mesa. Le Mesa. If he's supposed to be 36... And I'm gonna assume she's in her 20s at least. That puts... That does I not mean, paint a good picture. She could be 18. So, that would put... I wouldn't put it at just barely. <laughs> Anyway, so, uh, that would put him at like eight. Huh? Like, like, no, no. I mean, would be eighteen and eighteen? No, no, I'm, I'm bad. Shut yeah. up. Listen, we know my, you know, math is not my strong suit. Also, Lomisa posing when she's got that outfit. <laughs> it the wing me. flap. Yep. It's adorable. Anyway, I hope you'll have fun, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye! Nah.